Y'all come on over here and stick your in this oven. I want you to the most beautiful biscuits that you've had ever in your life. Look at this. I love the way a biscuit in a cast iron pan. Oh, it's though, and it's hot. Look at that, John. Look at those biscuits. Oh, I can't hardly wait to butter them and them along with this gravy. Well, let's move on, because the next thing I'm fixing to make is a chicken steak. This is one of these dishes where the different bowls up here. I've got one full of and I'm going to fill one with and I'm going to take our steak and your 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 steak is nothing but a round that you have had your butcher run it through a and it breaks the meat down because round is not typically a tender cut of meat. So it has to have some help in breaking down that meat so that it will get tender. Now I'm going to take our and I'm just going to sprinkle it with and then I'm going to run it through the and then into the and that is going to help it have a nice heavy I probably got about a half an inch of and it's not going to take long for this to cook at all. So let's start by a piece, and yeah, that's good. In fact, that might just be perfect. All right, let's look at our now because it's probably ready to flip. Yes, it is. And you'll want to do this gently so that your doesn't fall off because you want every bit of that all right, while that steak is up and it's about ready, I'm going to move the biscuits down here and I'm going to take the up and I'm going to let it for a second on a paper towel and now I'm going to that delicious white milk gravy that we down here. I'm going to ever so gently Somebody call 911 Shorty fire burning on the dance floor